Hi, today uh, I'm gonna talk about how to culture black worms. This is the best live food for fish. Fish love these black worms. And uh, so, what do you need uh, to culture the black worms? You're gonna need an aquarium. Um, I have a small aquarium here, it is easy to make a video. Uh, you can use anything, uh, basically. But I use this uh, uh, 2.5 gallon aquarium, and then uh, you're gonna need some gravel, and uh, I use this gravel. Uh, you just need a little bit. Uh, now we're gonna put just a, a layer of gravel. So the aquarium here, not too deep, just a. Uh, a single layer of uh, gravel uh, I will show you why we do that so basically it's just a really really uh, a, a layer of a uh, gravel here and then that's it you only need that much of a uh, gravel and uh, now you're gonna need water Pour the water here. Okay, you don't need uh, really much of uh, water. You just need just enough to to cover the, the air pump, uh, and then um, you're gonna go with that. Now I need to. Make sure this is all flat, just enough to black worm height between the gravel. Alright, now all you need to do is just the air pump. This is the source of the O2. Uh, for the black worms to live Okay, next step um, you're gonna put the black worms inside the aquarium But uh, before you do that make sure you have uh, the cold temperature for the water um, You're around under uh, 70 degree Fahrenheit uh, Because black worm live in the cold water Okay, let's see Black worms here, and we can put it there. There you go. So the black worms gonna hide between the gravel, um, and they just like to hide over there. And then now we talk about what kind of food for the black worms. Uh, I use, you can use anything organic, you can use some uh, uh, greens, uh, anything is uh, organic. Uh, I use this, uh, this is the katapa leaf, uh, I use it for my beta, so this is just use katapa uh, leaf, uh, so you just put it there, and that's all what they need. It's just the leaf uh, to, to eat, right? It's easy, simple. Okay, so make sure uh, the water is clean uh, because black worms like the water is clean. If, if the water is uh, getting dirty and you, you will see the black worms gonna be like go on top of over here at the aquarium. Out of the water, that's mean the, the water need to be changed. Uh, usually, I change every for like four or five days. Just take half of them, uh, fifty percent of the water, and uh, get it the, the fresh water uh, for them. Um, and then now we're gonna talk about how to re uh, production. Uh, well, black worms gonna multiply by uh, cut it by they, they're gonna cut itself and then they're gonna grow in each side 
So all you need to do is, you know, two, once every two days or once every three days, all you need to do just like mix the gravel here. So uh, the black worm is gonna be like get cut, and then um, that's the way they multiple. That's the way they reproduction. Uh, they just uh, getting cut, um, and then they're gonna grow longer. Okay, now um, we're gonna talk about how to harvest them, how to um, take them. Uh, look, they're, they're like hiding between the gravel. Uh, a lot of people are uh, uh, wondering how to uh, get them from the gravel. Uh, I found the easiest way uh, to harvest them, to get them for your fees. Uh, I bought these from eBay. Um, if, you, if you need this, uh, you can uh, ask me in the comment or, or, or I can uh, give you the link. Uh, this is very, very fine, like a super fine um, net. Uh, it's, it's good for uh, you know baby brain shrimp or, or dabnia or uh, black worms this is super easy uh, okay let me show you how to do this first you just need to again like mix it and then uh, you see the the black worms is flying away um, between uh, in the aquarium all you need to do is just grab your nets and get it as much as you need it and you see uh, only the uh, the black worms here so it's this this is the best way to harvest them see this is all you need okay if you need this um, you can you know if you are in the US uh, if you need this uh, I bought this from eBay. You can uh, ask me later on in the comment. Okay, guys, uh, this is the end of the video. I hope this is helpful um, to culture the black worms. Mm. You can keep feeding your fish with the live black worms, make them happy and healthy. Uh, if you like this video, subscribe and I see you in the next video. Thank you. Thank you.